First thing we're gonna do is remove one of the seats. We're gonna be removing the passenger side today. We're gonna start by removing the nuts off the 13 millimeter bolts in the front. Then we're gonna slide our seat forward and remove the two 18 millimeter nuts off the studs. We're working on an X3 XRC edition today. So we have the factory installed harnesses. If you don't have the factory installed harnesses, you'll have to remove this bolt located right here to remove the seat belt from the seat. Once you've done that, we'll just go ahead and remove the seat. Or if you have an XRC, you'll just pull your harnesses through the seat here, lay them down out of the way. Then just go ahead and remove the seat from the machine. Then we're gonna remove the Allen headed screw out of the top of the grab handle here. Then just remove the plastic there, or the rubber cover, sit that aside. Then we're gonna grab a hold of our shift knob, just loosen it up and go ahead and take it off the side as well. We're gonna come in here with the T30 Torx. We're gonna remove this screw, this screw, these two screws, and then another screw in the same position on this opposite side. Once all the screws are removed, we're gonna take something that you can shove down in between the plastic here to remove this lower cover. Sometimes you can just pick up on the console a little bit and slide this out to the side. Just go all the way down through there and do that. Remove this side panel and set it aside for the time being. Then we're gonna come back here and remove the two push pins. Then we're gonna pop the opposite side side panel away from the center console here. Once it's pulled away, go ahead and remove the center console piece. Then we're gonna grab our Allen and remove this screw. There's a screw right up here and there's also one up underneath of here. For this front one, what you're gonna wanna do is just pick up on the dash a little bit right here, reach in behind, get your socket on there, and then just go ahead and loosen it up. Remove the factory shifter gate. And you're gonna grab the new Super ATV one. You wanna make sure that this clip right here is in place with this notch right here, right next to the high. Then we're gonna go ahead and install it. You'll just wanna grab a hold of your shift lever here, slide it into the new Super ATV shifter. Line your holes up. Grab your factory Allen headed hardware. Go ahead and reinstall all your screws. Then again, for this one, just pick up on it a little bit. Get your screw started in there. And just go ahead and fully tighten all three of these Allen headed screws. Then we're gonna grab our center console. Go ahead and reinstall it. Make sure you slide the back end as you're sliding it over top of the grab handle bar here. And you're just going to want to guide all of your clips back into the center console. And we're going to grab the opposite side panel that we just removed. We're going to go ahead and get it slid back into place. Make sure it lines up at the bottom as well as the top. Just go through and make sure it's good and snapped everywhere. And we can go ahead and start reinstalling our hardware. Reinstall the rear push pins. We're just gonna go through and fully tighten all the hardware now. Then before you put your shift knob and your grab bar cover on, you just wanna go through, go through all the gears. So right there, we're in park, it's showing park. Right there, we're in reverse. It looks like it's sitting in reverse pretty good. Neutral, showing neutral. And we're gonna go all the way down here to low, show them we're in low, show them we're in high there. Then in reverse and back to park. So it looks like it's doing good. We're gonna go ahead and reinstall our shift knob. And 
And I'll grab handle cover here. We'll go ahead and tighten the hardware for it. Then we're gonna reinstall our seat. And that's how super easy it is to install Super ATV's gated shifter on this Can-Am Maverick X3. For more information on this gated shifter, or any of Super ATV's great products, give us a call at 855-743-3427, or check us out online at superatv.com. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.